The Media Academy for Journalism and Communication, with support from the U.S. Embassy in the Gambia, held a graduation ceremony for over 30 trainees under the project, strengthening CSOs and media for improved democracy and good governance. The ceremony marked the completion of three months of proactive advocacy training for 20 civil society organization members, while 20 community radio journalists completed a four-month course in interactive radio programming. Funded with 15,000 U.S. dollars, the project aimed to equip civil society and media professionals with the skills to promote good governance and enhance the democratization process in the Gambia. At the event, Mr. Modujuf, Secretary General of the Gambia Press Union and a training resource person, emphasized the need for effective and efficient CSOs to engage the government and governance issues. He urged both the media and CSOs to utilize the environment created for them to hold the government accountable. With the knowledge gained through this project, um, CSOs should be more proactive in engaging with government and policymakers and development partners as a proactive measure to be involved in activities of government related to political, economic, policy and legal issues and administrative decisions. To not only keep power in check, but also to contribute your quota in the country's democratic processes thereby enhancing good governance. Already, an environment has been created for Gambians and residents of the Gambia to enjoy a variety of news and information from a diverse range of media outlets or platforms. Both civil society and the media should fully utilize this opportunity to not only hold the government to account, but also to significantly improve public awareness in the form of civil education Campaigns. Mr. James Baji, Director of Training at Majak, encouraged the graduates to use their newly acquired knowledge to champion good governance and democracy. As we move forward, let us remember that the journey does not end here. The knowledge and skills you have gained are tools to be wielded with responsibility and integrity. Continue to be champions of democracy, advocates of, for good governance and catalysts of positive change. I urge each of you to take the lessons learned and skills acquired and put them into action. Be the change makers our communities desperately need. Use your voice, your platforms, and your influence to inspire and mobilize others. Challenge the status quo. Demand transparency and work tirelessly to ensure that the principles of democracy and good governance are upheld. Suzanne Solomon, public affairs officer at the U.S. Embassy in Banjul, explained the embassy's commitment to empowering CSO members and community radio journalists through this training. I think that what makes attending journalism program commencement so special for us is that these initiatives are reflective of our shared values. Freedom of the press is an essential right enshrined in the United States Constitution and a core principle of democracy. Restrictions on journalists often run counter to de democratic ideals, and journalists should be able to, be, to freely investigate, research, publish, and disseminate news, information, and opinions online and offline without fear of reprisal. The media is truly a pillar of healthy democracies. That is why the U.S. Embassy commits to helping Gambian journalists and why we are honored to have sponsored this initiative with MAGEC. MAGEC is producing leaders, journalists, and media experts who will be at the forefront of ensuring equality, transparency, democracy, economic prosperity, and social justice. Fatundur, a graduating CSO member, said how she is applying the skills she gained during the training in her role as a youth parliamentarian. I am pleased to see that through this model, I, I provide free graphic design services, such as certificates and flyers to the communities that I am represented. Additionally, I assist individuals in optimizing their social media handles and transform my own Facebook profile from personal to professional. Abdurrahman Jalo, a graduating community radio journalist, expressed his gratitude to Majak for the valuable training. I'd like to extend our heartfelt thanks to the Majak management and staff for their dedication and unwavering support have been instrumental in making this program success. Your expertise, passion and commitment in enhancing our community media 
landscape have provided us with invaluable tools and insights. Maja continues to offer various programs on communication and governance for journalists and CSO members, aiming to prepare Gambian activists and journalists to hold the government and other stakeholders accountable. Reporting for Kerpato, I am Ramatulai Jao.